My cervical mucus is like skull glue. What does that mean, and do I need to worry about it? Your cervical mucus is usually sticky, gooey and white. This is more than a little like that. If it is gummy or sticky like school glue, we'll just say you are not fertile. What would indicate fertility? If it is shifting from the normal thick, white and gooey to creamy like lotion, you are shifting to your fertile stage. Meaning about to ovulate. When cervical mucus is clear, watery and slipper like egg whites, you are at your most fertile. It takes on that consistency to let the sperm in. After that point, it starts to shift back to white, sticky and gooey. It becomes even more glue-like and crumbly right before your period. I've heard the cervical fluid dries up. We'll say it just decreases a lot, though it can dry out like that if you are very dehydrated or taking a decongestant. I've never heard of that as a side effect of decongestants. Normally, a woman sick enough to need those is not feeling like having sex, much less checking her cervical mucus for fertility signs. So a normal white cervical mucus could become glue-like if I was taking decongestants or dehydrated, even if it is not right before my period. We'll just say that if the cervical mucus is white or light yellow with tiny clumps like dried paste or wet glue, you're really infertile, as you would be if it was just white and tacky. It feels really weird to be talking about this. If it felt like crumbling Play-Doh pieces, dry and pasty, you'd know you were in an infertile phase. I hated the way it looked on my underwear. The infertile phase cervical mucus can look like dried out white spots that sit on the underwear, instead of the watery fertility phase stuff that seeps straight into the underwear. The only thing I'm used to monitoring my underwear for is period blood. Now you know that the infertile period mucus can leave a similar white crust, but it is about as hard to wash out as the blood. The only difference is that it cannot leak through to leave a distinctive splotch on my pants. If it is white and sticky and starts to shift to pink or brown discharge, you do know your period is about to start. Well, I won't miss the distinctive red spot that indicates when it has started.